It was um, it was kind of difficult in the beginning. There was some pushback um, from people who will remain unnamed. Uh, but there, you know, I am a stubborn, <laughs> stubborn person, and when I believe in something, I will continue to push and push for it, and I got it eventually. But it was difficult. So all coaches, regardless of sport, are required to take training courses in your how to be a coach in your specific sport so you know the rules, concussion courses, first aid courses, CPR courses, all of these courses we have to take because God forbid one of our athletes gets hurt or we do something and it's an illegal stunt in the case of cheerleading, you can get disqualified. The Cheerleading Association of Vermont will actually, can, they actually have the power to say your school is not allowed to have a cheerleading team anymore. So our first year, we were not a varsity sport. So I was told by some people higher up that I didn't need any of these courses. It would be good to take, but it wasn't a requirement. We got about halfway through the season when I was uh, approached by the president of the Vermont Cheerleaders Association, Cheerleading Coaches Association, the VCCA, uh, and she informed me that regardless of it being a varsity sport or not, I was required to take these courses. Uh, luckily, we were a non-mount cheerleading team and we weren't stunting or doing anything crazy and nobody got hurt, but if we were and something happened, it could have been a really, really, really big deal. And in finding out that I did need that information, I did need to take those courses, it was really frustrating because the person who told me this should have known, right? So it was very frustrating and it kind of put the team on hold until I got those, course, those courses taken. So it, it just threw a big wrench into the center in the middle of the season. It was just one more wall that we had to climb over to become varsity, but we did eventually win. It was very frustrating. You know, spend the extra time after school to coach the girls because I think it's important to provide as many extracurricular, non-academic opportunities for students. And the student body that joined the cheerleading team, a lot of them were not involved in after school activities uh, prior to the cheerleading team, and so it, it gave another route for students or another avenue for students to kind of, you know, spend some time not sitting on the couch and watching TV or walking around aimlessly and not doing their homework. It gave them something organized, athletic, right? We keep our, trying to get our kids healthy and, you know, being on a team brings their academic standards higher because there's certain requirements they have to kind of accomplish and hit along the way. And so the 13 girls that we had this year, you know, they, by the end of the season, not one was failing in class, I don't think. Um, so that is why I spend, I'll take my extra time out of my family time, uh, because I see value in it. You know, I think it's a good opportunity for the girls to, to have. Cheerleading for me and getting out of my shell, it was tough at first. I was never comfortable in my uniform, but I love to do it, and I don't know, it's helped me a lot though. I do feel more confident at, than I You know, MV's never had a cheerleading team, so everybody was saying a bunch of crap about it, and you know, we didn't really have a football team to cheer for to begin with anyways, so we were cheering for the basketball team, and you know, we didn't have... We didn't have like brand new uniforms. They were nice uniforms, but like some of us didn't match. But and a lot of us girls on the cheerleading were a little bit bigger, so we or we were like full size or like plus size, and we were getting a lot of hate for it. So I have a lot of good moments with cheerleading. Um, I can't even pick one. Probably learning how to stump for the first time. That was really exciting. Greatest thing ever. Cheerleading has been a really great addition to the school. I love the energy, the excitement, the camaraderie. More kids involved in a team sport. 
more kids supporting other kids doing team sports. Couldn't be better. So happy about cheerleading, it's awesome. What do I think about them? Yeah. Uh, I think that they have gone from uh, here to here in a really short period of time. Here being sort of trying to figure it out, not really very good at first because they were just learning it. And they've gone from, you know, we've got spirit, yes we do, we've got spirit, how about you? To actually throwing kids up into the air and catching them and twisting and doing all kinds of crazy stuff. So from here to here, it's fantastic. They're awesome. Okay. Anytime you can get more kids involved in something that's related to the school, research says they'll do better in school, they'll less likely to use drugs and alcohol, their social relationships will improve, their academic performance will improve. So anytime you can get more kids involved in something positive, from my perspective, it's a it's a win-win-win. Win, win. Yeah. My opinion on cheerleading is that the cheerleading here is awesome because they're awesome cheerleaders. And what more can I say? They're just great and they're doing great things for the school. Because um, they do great things for the school. They're building school spirit and they're making, they're making this a better school for not only for themselves, but for everybody. For kids on teams they cheer for, for other kids who want to participate and, are, and now have an opportunity to do it, for the fans who come to our games, just, it's just great. Okay. It was exciting to see a lot of young people participate. I like how the team worked and got the crowd motivated through their cheers. Uh, and the team provided us with lots of school spirit. Exciting to see a group of young people uh, encourage players to do their best. Uh, and the cheer team excited the crowd for all home games. I would encourage all young people to participate in a varsity sport. I, as well as players and coaches and fans, enjoyed watching the cheer team. They um, marketed our athletic programs with their support. They created community patriotism, which is school spirit. And I look forward to supporting the MVU cheerleading team in the future. I want students to have a positive experience while attending MVU by participating in an athletic experience here, like cheerleading, it fosters leadership, discipline, commitment, and sense of responsibility to our community. We did a lot to prepare for the competition. Like we were practicing months before and it was really fun though. cheerleading because it's fun and I love just being a part of a team and we work so hard to fundraise for to get like new stunting mats that are really nice and new uniforms and but there's a lot of love in our team you know we're not just a team we're a family